Salam and hi. This video will show you how to build a cross requirements plan. It based on material requirements planning MRP. What is gross requirement plan? It is a schedule. It combines a master production schedule and the time based schedule. It shows when an item must be ordered from suppliers if no inventory on hand or when the production of an item must be started to satisfy demand for the finished product by a particular date. In today's lesson, we are going to take a look at example 2, building a cross requirements plan. Each awesome speaker kit item A of example 1 requires all the items in the product structure for A. Lead times are shown in table 14.2. Using the information in example 1 and table 14.2, we construct the cross material requirements plan with a production schedule that will satisfy the demand of 50 units of A by week 8. For that, we prepare a schedule as shown in table 14.3. You can interpret the cross material requirements shown in table 14.3 as follows. If you want 50 units of A at week 8, you must start assembling A in week 7. Thus, in week 7, you will need 100 units of B and 150 units of C. Thus, in week 7, you will need 100 units of B and 150 units of C. These two items take two weeks and one week respectively to produce. Production of B therefore should start in week 5 and production of C should start in week 6. The lead time extracted from the required date for this item. Working backward, we can perform the same compute computations for all of the other items because D and E are used in two different places in awesome speaker keys. There are two entries in each data record. That's all. Thank you.